This video is going to take you through setting up your site and cleaning it up ready for use. Uh, okay, so first thing you do, you go into your site, uh, denrock.com, and what we want is the cPanel. Oh no. Now I use HostGator to, to, uh, to host all my sites, and the cPanel on HostGator is absolutely fantastic. So I'm already signed in, as you'll see now. Uh, when you do it to yours, you're gonna ha at first you're going to have to put your username and password that HostGator give you, and then you uh, carry on from there. Now here I'm going to type FAN, and I go into Fantastico. Now this Fantastico is actually in the list. I'll just show you now where the Fantastico is. Once you're in cPanel, you have to scroll down like this until you find it down here. Now, I don't. I just go into Find, and I click FAN, and there's Fantastico. Now, what we're going to do here, we're going to go in make a WordPress site. So I'm going to click on WordPress, and I'm going to do a new installation. Right, first of all, it's on denrock.com. Yes, that's where I want it. I'm installing it on the main directory. I'm uh, I'm not going to make a directory, and the admin name I'm going to use for this is admin. Here, and I'll do the password in a minute uh, because it actually shows up in uh, letters, numbers, and symbols, whatever you use. It doesn't come up in stars, so I'm not going to put that in for a minute admin nickname I use my own name Dennis I never hide it I don't see why I should I'm not doing anything wrong and I use support at denrock.com then uh, site name is whatever the password whatever the uh, keyword is that you use to buy your site for instance um, okay, let's think of one I bought a site recently what was it how to pick up women that was it how to pick up women, description the same, an honest pickup artist review, is this a scam? That's great. Now, I'm going to pause this, and I'm going to uh, put my password in here, and then I'm going to be on the next page, so I'll show you, okay? Okay, I clicked on uh, the install now, and then it's finish installation. Now, I'm going to click on finish installation but I can't show you that page because it's got the password on it as well but I will show you something else on the next page so I'm going to pause it again okay uh, the password is just above this but it's this this is the link to your WP um, admin now of the new site so I'm going to click on that and then I'll show you the next page And there you go. The next page is actually the sign in. And as you saw, I did admin and the password. I've um, I've been in here before, so I'm just showing you uh, what you do. You put your username, which I use, was admin, and the password. Uh, I'm going to click remember me, and I'm going to log in. And this takes us to the dashboard. And I'm going to dismiss this, and I'm going to dismiss this, and we'll be on the dashboard now. I'm going to run you through exactly what you've got to do. So you click on all posts first. We don't want this. We trash it. Okay, that's gone. The next thing we look at is the links. All links. Now, links going away from your site actually it leaks uh, link juice and what I mean by that is you don't want to give these people here WordPress WordPress uh, uh, codex any any link juice that you you know that you need for your your own so you click on the name then bulk actions delete and I'm deleting every one of these because they're nothing to do with me or to my site and click apply they've gone okay Next is pages, all pages. There's a sample page, trash it. Okay, now I go into trash and sample page, delete permanently. Okay, 
Next thing we do, we go into appearance, we go for, uh, sorry, we don't, we go into users, all users. Right, this is my admin support here, so I'll click on edit this and come down here make sure display name publicly Dennis contact yes support about myself and I'm not going to do that I'm going to do something else okay don't need to do anything there it's all okay uh, next thing you look at um, appearance and I want to no it's pages post categories that's it that's the next thing categories and this is uncategorized so what we're going to do is edit this and on here I'm going to put how to pick up women okay and the slug it, it doesn't matter when you update the category the slug gets done for you so don't worry okay that's the category change the next thing we go to is the settings now we go into general this is quite a little bit of work but it needs to be done click anyone will register and save changes that's the only thing to change on the general now we go into writing writing uh, we really need to enable atom and we enable the wordpress movable xml rpc this is for some software some softwares need you to be uh, enabled this to be enabled in order for the software to run so it's worth doing immediately straight away it, it it doesn't help you straight away but if you do go if you do get software at least you know it's already done this is a great way of just preparing for everything okay then what we do there we save the changes this pingomatic part here will ping your automatically ping your your uh, site Okay, that's it. Uh, let's make sure standard broker how to pick up women. Fine, that's everything there. Now we go into reading. Shouldn't have anything on there, but let's have a look. Reading, no, everything's fine on that. Discussion the same. There's not much to change in discussion. There is one thing: an administrator must always approve the comment. Always click that, and then anybody makes a comment on your site you can go come in here and you can have a look at the comments there's a, a thing here about comments here and um, when, when you click that it comes up on the comments page in a minute <laughs> there it is there's no comments but when you have comments you'll find them here and you can say yes or no to the comment that way you protect yourself from people swearing on there calling your names whatever I mean it does happen so anyway we've done reading now we're doing this we've done discussion media is nothing there privacy you leave as is and next thing is the permalinks we come into the permalinks and what we do here we're going to custom structure so that there's only the post name and I'll show you how I do it I click day and name and then from there back to there I delete so that what's left is a forward slash a percentage mark post name percentage mark and a forward slash that is what you need to have in here for custom structure I will be showing you later on how now we come down and we save changes there are a couple more things that I missed out and I must go back and do them so I click on general okay we come back into the general and we come down here oh one moment I'm going to pause this no don't worry um, everything's fine uh, we're going into plugins next we're going to s add a new plugin that's our next we've cleaned all our site up ready for working now we go in for the all in one SEO all in one SEO search the plugins and this is the one you want all in one SEO pack install ok to install it's very quick activate the plugin 
Okay, now we go down here and we'll look, and you can see under the settings, I'll, I'll make it come up underneath it, so under the settings here, we've got the all-in-one SEO. Click on that, because we're going to enable it, right? Scroll down. Uh, I have already donated. I think this is a brilliant uh, plugin, and I've donated to the person that wrote it, because he's let us have it for nothing, and I think you should be paid something. And I, I'll sh tell you what I did. I donated five dollars. If every one of us donates five dollars to this man, he's going to get paid well. Okay. Uh, firstly, I've got to do enable. Click enable, then put your title. How to pick up? Must impress. Always put your title. Every word with a capital starts with a. A capital letter pick up women and what I'll do there I'll copy that and I'll put it in here I normally would make another how to pick up women uh, using the uh, methods methods I learned word is how to pick pick up women then you want LSI keywords which are related keywords to your main keyword that are related so picking up women pick uh, pick up artist pick up girls etc 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 and then what we do then we come down here and we and uncheck use meta tags and uncheck the dynamically and what I do is I click, I check use no, no index for categories and I check no index for archives. And then I leave the rest and update the options. Okay, that's, now that's that uh, plugin done. So we want to add another plugin. Add new. Then I want to search for Google XML sitemaps Google XML sitemaps you'll notice when you're working on your computer that these will when you go into any of the sites after that you you build these will be already uh, there waiting for you to click on so Google XML sitemaps is for nearly five stars four and a half stars install now okay activate the plugin now you don't have to change anything in there that's perfect exactly as it is so we want another we want to add another plugin now this is this is a really really good plugin to have and what it is is pretty link so you search the plugins for pretty link and there's a pretty link use the light so install this okay and I can show you later then how in a different video uh, how you would use the pretty link okay so that's them all done and now the next thing uh, we'll do on the next video is starting to do your pages and your posts okay so uh, that's the next thing in the next video that's the end of this video I hope you've enjoyed it